Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I'm Sanjo, and welcome back to Castlevania Circle of the Moon, where we last up, left off, um, we did defeat the first form of Dracula, and did most of the cleanup, clean up. there's still some other cleanup I need to do, and I've completely missed that there was another part I needed to do involving it, but for now, I think now it's time to go on to the arena. We also get this nifty power up. Spiffy. But, um. Continuing onward, though, and not hitting the button that lets me use the map. That is, not start. Speaking of which, what do I have equipped? So you're still on Miracle Brand. A Miracle Arm Brand, my bad. Anything else that raises luck? I'm not steel arm. Wait, isn't this that raised luck? Okay, this raises luck. Along with this. Okay, good to know. Oh. So, my intention is to go to the place, the battle arena. Which is one. There we go. And get the items over here during, as well. Because cleanup's technically not over. Technically speaking. And there goes me burning shit. Actually, speaking of which, what does this drop anyway? Ah, yes. Actually, I could just do this and just get back the, the stuff I lost. That little one's gonna be there, and that's gonna be the pain in the butt. In the ass. And that's the problem, is that damn Lilum. Or Fallen. The name of these things changes, but either way, they the same damn mod, the same damn sprite, and that is... Thank you for the assistance, Fallen Angel. You actually helped me for once. Uh, but getting back on topic... We're gonna try and see if I can clear through all the rooms here. I don't think I will, but because I have relied too much on magic, but considering I have 205 hearts, I say I have a better chance of living. Gauntlet, that's just a defense item. Okay, it covers two. Ah, shit. Speaking of which, this, uh, where am I here in terms of the, uh, yeah, just don't. Okay, there's a break. Here's a break.
Okay, let's see here. I think it's enough. It does lead into. Is there any? This is an exit. Oh yeah, but that's a problem. Yeah, it's an exit, but um, it's not an exit that people want to note, take notes of. So I kind of fuckled up. Sure. Makes it easier for me. But apparently okay, so there is no way back. That's that's disappointing. Once I go there. Well fuck. What was four anyway? Four is three stone armors and twelve. Devil Towers. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. I mean, so far I've been given a good idea. Gotta be careful. Now, I don't think I have to battle them all again unless I have to, in which case that's gonna be disappointing. Your mind power will be drained again? Oh, I gotta do this again. That's unfortunate. I thought I was...
Oh, damn it. For God's sakes! <laughs> ah, wow! <laughs> you know what? I'm just not really feeling it today. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just beat the game. I'm already getting tired of. I'm already getting tired of this fucking thing. Well, I want to try to see if I can beat the devil up, up that's up uh, back at the at a certain specific area because I got a feeling if I grind off him, I would get a, a surplus of EXP. I don't know how much the damn thing does, but give but it's a safe a bet considering it's a pretty damn strong enemy itself a very strong regular enemy apparently i mean now granted i could be wrong it does come off as a bit of a mini boss type enemy not gonna lie along with the fallen angel the lilums you know just the things that just look like just recolored succubi and, and let's let's be honest it's just literally just recolored Ocubus. How about let's not do that, please? For the love of that is God, stop that. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna fight. No. No. It, it's gonna be tedious. I'm just gonna fight Drac. Oh my god, the amount of it. The amount of that fucker spawns. Holy shit. Speaking of which, I actually should change my armor here. Do I have anything better than what I currently have? No. But I do need something increasing my strength now. Actually, hold on one second. There's a cheat. 
There's a glitch with this DS system. I'm planning on fucking using it. I don't like doing it, but I'm doing it anyway. What is it called? DSS glitch. Okay, here we go. Oh, what the fuck did I do here? Okay, this room is not back. Okay, this is interesting. Okay, let's see here. Okay, this doesn't do anything, but okay, let me let me go back to DSS. Let me just select. Let me just set them up here. I'm assuming the last one's unicorn, cause ah, shit. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna Mars's attack. So okay, let's see here. DSS. What's this at the back here? It's a, it's a gun. <laughs> With a long ass wind up. Okay, no, that's the black dog. Okay, I know what it is. Okay, there's a bunch of fucking around now. DSS. Now let me just see all the attack ones this year. What do we got here? Oh, we got a wide arc swing. That freezes apparently. That's pretty cool. So let's see here. I'm, kind of, I'm curious on the combinations here. Wait, what? Win the battle arena without having I having high level. This can be considered as cheating. Okay. It's a battle area. Speed and accuracy. Some of D uh some of D E D S combination of the D D S glitch. An area you will see that your MP will not turn into zero instantly, but will deplete quickly. At least you have your idea now. Heat your summon before your MP depletes completely. Just use MP store item, then unpause and quickly activate the yes, then quickly summon fucking thing. Holy shit. So you're starting to summon uh, a very useful glitch, especially when cheating in the arena. <laughs> um to execute the summon when you're about to fly in the air, just pause. Change your car combination to Mars and Dog. Okay. Oh man, you know I just want to play this around. Let's see here. Equip items that can find I mean, strength penalty that is equal to or greater than your strength. While the game indicates that you have one strength. Actually having one strength is not enough to activate this glitch. Your choice is a matter that any DSS car combo will activate this glitch. Once both connections... Spinning... The first one. Okay, that's not what I wanted to see, but okay. There is a lot of things here. Okay, okay, let's hear. Okay, so now that I know how it works, at least.
I need to see the combinations. For God's sakes, Discord! Cockatrice. Okay, oh, it's stone. That's what it is. Riffin. Thunderbird. The Holy Whip is for the unicorn and it's the one before the black dog. So it's the second last one. Salamander. Or, wait. Wait, wait, hold on. Oh, these are the combinations here, okay. Okay, Venus. I figured Mars would do the most damage considering it's the Mars uh, the gods involved is the god of war. At least you think. A oh, different infused weapon, okay. Yeah, no, that that's pretty much useless. For God's sakes, man, what the hell? Okay. The Manticore with, what is it? Venus. That's not bad. Ooh! I can actually increase my luck with, uh, with that's for fuck sakes. Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. Walking XP. Excuse me? And this is Venus, right? Okay, that, you know, that could be beneficial. That's actually pretty, this is pretty good. All these combinations sound pretty good. I'm sorry if I'm making everyone look at a blank at a, in one screen the entire time. Stop. Okay, I can actually increase my strength. This creates the stats. Mars changes the weapon choice. Ice sword, yeah, that's right. A sword not attacks with a uh, attack with a rose sword. Massive hammer, which kinda sucks. Attacks with tonfers. You mean tonfas? With Poison Claw, with Mana Core. Wait a minute. This is Mars. 
is here, and Griffos is, Griffin is the third one from Golem, which I have. Okay, let me try something here. It's here. One, two, three. Okay. Let's see what this is all about. Yo! That looks sick! So he goes full on samurai on that shit. Martial arts attacks. Hold attack to perform combinations. Are lacking in range, of course. The Holy Sword! You don't! Which is the second to last one. Oh shit! What the fuck? Oh man, this is broke! Yo, this is broke as fuck. I want to try this shit out. I, I, I'm not gonna lie. I want to try this all against the man himself. Actually, let's see your items. Oh man, I, I, I want to see if this works. Oh, this this sounds way broken as fuck. And I'm already loving it. I want to try this shit out. <laughs> you know what? What better boss? You know what? Yeah, what better boss? What better way to test this shit out other than the devil himself? Okay, let's see here. Um, did I not? Uh, I didn't yet. There we go. Come at me, Satan! What am I doing? <laughs> Wait, did I kill him? Now makes sense. Did I kill him? I don't even know how much that fucker drops though in terms of experience though. That's the thing. But that's it. This shit seems dope. I can actually kill some of this shit with ease. Bastards can be easy to kill with this shit. Yo, that's pretty cool. Wish I looked this up earlier. Same the hassle in some boss fights. <laughs> but then again, I think everything would end up getting broken. You know what? Let's actually test this out on a boss. On an actual boss boss, mind you, not a 
not what would be classified as a boss by the fact that they're just really fucking hard to kill. Boss like, I guess, would be the correct words. I also went mind to look at something else as well. That EXP walker kind of looks um, beneficial, although it would be probably early shit though. Tag with a gun, bullshit. Like hell, I'm gonna do that. Uh, Diana, which is after Mars, is here. A corresponding element with the whip. Okay. What else? Wait. A guided shell. That sounds pretty good. So, so far the two ones that seem interesting enough is the guided shell, the jet, the holy sword. An arrow of light. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, wait, wait. I gotta see this shit real quick. Um, okay, let's hear. DSS. Diane's after Mars. Okay, so. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get out of this first. DSS. Diane. Unicorn. Or. No, no, no. Shit. No, it's Apollo. At least I believe it's Apollo. Mars produces the Holy Sword. Dinah, Dinah not Diane, Jesus. Produces the ball. Yeah, the guided shell in Apollo, which is done by a half circle forward motion or a half circle up. Oh, that's kind of crappy. Well, no time like the present to be fun with this shit. Nope. And the black dog summons a Neptune. Uh, all Neptune's videos specifically kind of all uh, involve taking a kind of oh uh, no okay Neptune nope I don't care about Neptune Neptune has a drain. We summons familiar who attack in different manners. Bat familiar, ghost familiar, owl familiar, hawk familiar, Medusa familiar. Oh hell no. Gas familiar, Sprite, Crow, Cherub. There's just a lot of things I just... I am just very interested in this now. I'm more interested in the system itself. DSS. Okay, this one and this one. Hello? <gasps> oh, 
What the fuck? I summoned the unicorn! <laughs> Wait, so which one was that? That wasn't Saturn. Or at least I don't think it was. Was that Jupiter? Was that Neptune? Yeah, that's... Yeah, that's... Yeah, it's fucking, um... That's Jupiter. That's, uh... That's Neptune. Okay, so I was off by one. Okay. Man, the system is very interesting. I like it. So I still gotta keep doing this to activate the glitch, though. Let's see, we go all the way to the end. Yes. Where is it? Oh, I'm invincible! I am invincible. Okay. I must have skipped something then. No. No, 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 no. That okay. That was Uranus. So I skipped one. Shit. DSS. Is it this one? There it is. Oh, look at that thing. Oh, this will be beneficial. Man, I just... Oh, this just seems damn well interesting. I could lie. Oh, jeez, that's terrible. Oh, that's horrible. But, yeah, this is pretty cool. I like this. I like the setups. Ah, fuck! Actually, I may need a, like, an understanding on how much health this man has, maybe, as well. No. Dracula second form, yeah. But that, 1100 HP, okay. No, he has 3000 health, okay. Charge. He swings back rapidly and rushes when incredibly strong. And though when he teleports in and in this flashing, he's gonna charge, stand near him on one of the upper platforms and rock jump when he moves back on into the swing. Don't jump too early or you'll land on him. Or too late and get hit by him. Usually does this two to four times over. Yeah. Usually fewer times when he's close uh the closer he is to dying. If rock jumps perform at the top of a double jump or one of the platforms, Nathan will come close to hitting the ceiling or plane hit it. Happens there will be a large window of error at its timing as Dracula is limited how far up I begin chasing anything as such so jumping the moment the flash appears is effective and probably um uh, transforms into eyeball the same and one that his weak point is at the start of the fight though so right by cloud bats he doesn't necessarily fly at you but the cloud is large enough that the bats go off in random directions while the bats can just be destroyed in a single hit the ice count as drain uh only damage to the ice counts as draining HP he transforms after doing after he's done charging. So if he doesn't appear right away, and if you land, he's transformed and it's coming right from the top of the screen. 
Yeah, but when does he start doing the charge? Okay, let's see here. Uh, first, he'll use it to come to do, do, do. Once he's taken enough damage, he'll start. He'll... Okay, so. Okay, that doesn't tell me anything really. Is it a halfway point or not? Thunderbird. Which is... Saturn and... Now this might work. Uranus and Thunderbird, which was the second to last one. Um. Hmm. Okay, let's assume that the charge happens halfway, so most likely I would have them down, down to 1500 health left. In which case, I may need to summon the Thunderbird, which could actually help out in this situation. Which is Uranus and... The Thunderbird one, which is... This one, I'm assuming. Yeah, just... Don't realize what you're doing, please. There it is. Oh, that's the Griffin. Never mind. Holy shit! Okay, if this is the Griffin. This must be the Thunderbird then. There we go. <laughs> Whee! Well, at least I got an idea of it, at least. And that's the important thing, is that I got the idea of it. Charging on the time on this thing is a bitch, though. That's not what I thought I did.
<laughs> oh, what have I done? It is it is a waste and effort. I will never true I will never be truly gone. So long as the darkness and desire in the soul of man, I will continue to be revived, and we will be there to stop you. You can bet on that. Whee! I'm out of here. Master, are you well? Nathan, thank you. You did well. You have become a hunter in your own right. You, I need to thank you as well. But your training must begin anew. I know, Father. I will train like I was... Like I was reborn to become worthy. Hey, Nathan. If you become soft, I'll take over for you. Look forward to the challenge, Hugh. Yeah, I know, I recorded for a fucking hour. That's fantastic. Ugh. Not gonna lie. I did enjoy this game in the beginning. I did. But some of it just felt kind of weird after a while. And I got impatient. Impatient. If I wasn't as impatient as I... If I wasn't as impatient... I probably enjoyed this game a little bit more. It's an okay game, but... I don't know. I kind of liked... Uh, Harmony, of, uh, Harmony of Dissonance uh, better. Or, it is Harmony of Dissonance, ain't it? The other one? The one I actually played for the channel? The other Castlevania game I played for the channel? The size of this one. Or, I believe it's Dissonance. Uh. God, let's see go my channel. I'm pretty sure it's Dissonance. Playlist. Yeah. 
Harmony of Dis yeah, Harmony of Dissonance. I, well, I do have my issues with Dissonance. I felt like, I don't know. I feel like there were a bunch of feature, a bunch of things that you could do in Harmony of Dissonance that felt that that this game doesn't have, and I think I've been kind of spoiled with games that are very similar to uh, Symphony of the Night. And Harmony of Dissonance feels like a a true successor in terms of how the gameplay feels to Harmony, or not Harmony, Symphony of the Night. But, I mean, this game ain't bad. Uh, congratulations, you get the Magician's Password Fireball and put it on the name entry screen. Yeah, I've seen that. And, and it's not interesting at all. And, uh, but, yeah, you can go through... You can pretty much go through a lot of... You can pretty much go through the game... Essentially, you can go through the game again. Under a new name. Just something. Oh, hell no. But, uh, no, I'm, this game, it's fine. It's, it's, it's perfectly fine. It's serviceable. It's, it's a good game. The controls are okay. There are a few things I have a problem with. The, the DSS system, yes, I used the glitch of, used the glitch, making it a bit more easier to, di uh, to play the game. But, most people who are going to play this game and try to do it legitimately, they're not going to probably... They're probably going to be finding that grinding for the card is going to be tedious. And and that's going to be something that's uh, going to exist. Yes, in Circle of the Moon. It has ideas that could work. But I feel like it falls flat on them at times. And... This is a game that really, if you try to speedrun it haphazardly without using any, without using the DSS uh, the DSS glitch to your advantage, can be a bit of a bitch. And while I don't think I was speedrunning, I did make some headstrong uh, decisions that can be that is or rash decisions I should say, not headstrong. Rash decisions that is just completely idiotic to someone who is more tactical. And to that I agree. This game does not award people with a with a a headstrong or or uh or those who are just diving into the fight it guns um unprepared. Erdin just thinks, oh the whip is just more than enough. It, it's uh, and it kind of does punish you for that. And I did have that mentality for the most part. Which led to a lot of... Uh, to me dying a lot in these bosses. If I, But granted, it's not to say you couldn't grind. You can grind. This is technically an RPG. So, I could have just grind off screen. But I was kind of getting sick of the game. As is. Granted, the, the DSS... Uh, combinations did interest did pick up the interest a little bit more but at the same time I just did not fucking care or at the end of it all if and I think that and I do enjoy and I do enjoy this game as much as I just I do enjoy this game it's just not as much as I believe as harmony of dissonance a good game still just this one, out of the few Castlevania games I played, this is kind of hitting a low bar. It, it kind of a low bar here. This is kind of like, this would probably be better off as your first Castlevania, and yeah, uh, first rather than just playing something like Cynthia Knight or Harmony of Dissonance because those feel pretty damn good in terms of gameplay. Don't get me wrong, there are problems in both of them that irk me. Although I haven't, although I haven't done a playthrough of it, but I have played Symphony of Night, and I do enjoy playing that game. But other than that, mm, fairly fine game. And it's just I feel like some of it wasn't done well. And to be fair, I kind of wish there was alternate endings, you know, to make it feel like you should work towards something. And I think it's because of that lack of you need to work for something that kind of diminished my interest in the game more so. 
But overall, that's just my opinion. And again, I still enjoyed the game for what it was worth. And I do hope you enjoyed this Let's Play. And if you did enjoy it, why don't you do me a favor and hit that like button. Also, if you want to keep up to date to more videos I post on the channel, hit that subscribe button. And if you feel like it, click that bell icon to turn on notifications. With that said, I will see you all in another Let's Play. Latest.